Iron Bear. This is what we do. It's who we are. Let me know in the, in the comments if you spotted a, a bear that you, you think you would more likely be. Did I, um... Yeah, I did. I went to the... Like the enchanter and put 35 stat signs for something else. Okay. It's fine. Step one. Sell the sacreds. So those ancestral uh, yellows look fine. Let's see what else we got. Away from the shop. Preferably so I don't accidentally sell it. Cool. We were looking for a ring that had that effect in case I wanted to go two-hander. So that's brilliant. I can now go two-hander. Once I find in, uh, the other source of what was giving me grizzly rage in my in my bank. I think it was, you know, that you can put it on, on gloves. I don't even know, I didn't even keep a copy of it yet. Ugh. There's another ring with it on. Which isn't what we're looking for. Why do I have a ring with less time on it, when I have a ring with better time on it? Why? 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 <laughs> um... I don't even know. But yeah, there's there's one area where we could um, heal the effect off of it. That was the two-hander we were going to try and equip if we can get this all sorted out. So let's bring um, this one that's over here. This over here, this is our thinking pile. Bear Rage on Gloves. There you are. Just three seconds instead of five or six or four. But it's fine. So we're gonna lose 39%, which is huge. Critical strike damage to crowd controlled enemies, but they're not always crowd controlled. Okay. Yeah, I'll put this on this tab where it's gonna make sense to figure this all out. We're gonna wear the gloves. Take that back. Store these. We're gonna wear. The, the much mightier prog effect two-hander. And then, uh, of course, that will require us to store the off-hand and uh, the one-hander. And then... Didn't need the ring. Put that on. Keep that safe. Put that on. So we have all the same effects now, uh, if that was confusing at all, the way I sped through it a bit, except for the Earth skills doing the 39% more damage. But instead, instead, we have gained the double damage proc on this, and this should be more DPS overall when we get over to the guy. And, um, yeah, it's just another way to, to try things out. Keeping, putting up, uh, yeah. Get put on this tab again. Uh, wow, that's massive. Yeah, 
Yeah, that's actually kind of good for this spec because we do do a chunk of things with Pulverize. Pulverize is actually a beast. Especially seeing as we've got three effects coming off it. We've got the Shockwave, the DOT rumbling on the floor, and uh, some of the base effects on it already. Uh, and that's really nice too. That goes in the, the first tab because that's uh, quite generic. So we're going to sell this aspect down here. And we're going to turn this into an aspect as well. And upgrade everything. Have a look around. See what we do. See how two-handed goes for us for a while. Unexpected. 5001. Come back if you need work. Would have made more sense if I had looked at the uh, the old set of stuff. That's, that's easy enough to do. We can do that. It's going to be funny if it goes down, but because of the cool, the cool proc on Pulverize being mightier. We'll have to see. Also, I didn't upgrade the, the ring yet, so... Weapon, gloves, ring, ring, gloves, weapons, plural. Five thousand seven hundred nineteen. Uh oh. Did I do the wrong ones? No. Yes? Yes. Um, yeah, so that's a little bit alarming, 5719. Mm. We'll visit some people. Willpower. Hmm. <laughs> Already. Let's um change this up. Ooh. Both nice. Both nice. I like attack speed though. Like when you get that shrine that makes you fire the arrows off and gives you the attack speed, the attack speed works on everything. So you don't have to worry about being like a like an auto attacker or something, you know. Check the time. Now these are all awful, but that's probably the best of the awfuls. Let's do it again. And again. Oh. Wow. 
so fail, and now it costs the world, and I don't even have it. There goes all the money, just... Pow. But, um... Yeah, you know, this doesn't always paint the full picture. Like, this one has some, like, you know... Uh, where was it? On gloves? No, I can't remember where it was, but, yeah. We'll see. 80, 85% overpower damage. I don't think that's present on this one. Yeah. 84% damage to healthy enemies as the as the, the get-go. This is only half that, because it's a one-hander. And that tiny little bit of cooldown reduction, just, you know, I'm not sure if they, they're equal in all things. But yeah, I don't need to justify everything all the time. I'm not a maths guy. I'm just I'm just out here having fun. Overpower damage again. Then on ring, let's 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 sort of see what we're doing with regards to um distances. Wow, we've got some really low stuff. So we could have 19% for one. We could have 7% to all resistances. I'd kind of like to pluck out these fire ones now that we're not doing that crazy boss anymore. And just do all three at 7%. But for now, I think we'll just fix up our shadow. A bit. And then, uh, you know, hope people don't hit us with poison. Just like say, no, sir, I refuse. I think that's everything. Uh, oh, we're already at the occultist, which was the one NPC that I needed for the last thing before we can get going again. Please extract the aspect so that I have a one of these. I didn't make space yet. What happens if I click it? It's on the floor. It's on the gosh darn floor. Ah. Okay, we pre-planned what we were gonna sell. Use this one. Don't drop my cool stuff on the floor, game. We're looking for little little quests we can do. Let's do that one. This was like level ten or fifteen or whatever level I was, where the guy was just like, "I'm a dying knight on the floor." Uh, our captain fell in battle. We went to bury him, and he rose as a vampire. And this is, this is the story of that. He said, you know, please go give our captain a proper death and a proper burial. We don't want to remember him as the vampire that's, that slew us all. And we're good guys, we're going to get on that, but it took us a while. We had some prior engagements, and, and he died anyway, I think, telling us that story, so, you know. There's no need for him to uh, to know that we took a while. We'll just keep that to ourselves. 